What's up, Tiger Learners? I'm Dr. B, and welcome to Salem U's Online Orientation Tutorials. In this video, we're going to navigate to Blackboard, our online class platform. Let's go to class. Okay, Tiger Learners, you're going to go ahead and fire up your learning machine, aka your laptop or desktop, uh, or working from your mobile device. And you're going to pick your browser of choice. Uh, I prefer Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox, or you're going to download the Blackboard app. And we're going to navigate directly to the website. We want to remember it. We're going to add it to our bookmarks, but it's just going to be uh, SalemU.Blackboard.com, uh, and then we're going to go right there, and that's going to take us to our login page. Um, and you're going to sign in, and once you sign in, it's going to bring you right here to your um, organization page. And the big thing to remember in Blackboard is our left-hand navigation. Uh, everything in Blackboard happens on the left-hand side. So when in doubt, go back to the left hand. But as you, you're logged in here, um, you are going to uh, see your organization page. So you, you, and the organization page is going to be the primary homepage for Blackboard, and it's going to have information, um, you know, that's generally of purpose for you. For example, um, the first thing here is about Tutor.com, which is our uh, free help for free academic help uh, for for Salem students. So you have access uh, to Tutor.com in each of your courses. Um, so more information about that. I particularly want to call your attention to the syllabus addendum section. This is important information about uh, policies and procedures in each of your courses. Uh, the virtual library is how you'll access our online library resources. So this is also available in the organization page here in Blackboard. And then the Salem University student resources here as well. Uh, and we're going to look at that real quick. But you can see everything from academic support, uh, for uh, the link to sign into your student email account, the link to sign into your student portal, access to the Writing Center, um, which is another uh, tutoring service we offer for paper writing, uh, access to student services, uh, your access to live text should you need it, and then information on the academic calendar and the, the university student handbook. And again, that's all going to be available to you from your organization page here uh, in Blackboard. Now again, r r using the left-hand navigation, there's things we can view. You'll have your own profile. Uh, you can set up and add your picture. You can uh, change your password. You can set your notifications for classes. I highly encourage you to you know, choose a photo and update it here with your information. That way your instructors know who you are uh, and can see you in class. Um, other fancy things here in the left-hand navigation, your activity stream will tell you about uh, things about classes that you need to know about, um, such as when things are due or when you need to turn things in. Um, <clears throat> we have a calendar here, so you can you know use it to track dates and due dates and things of that nature. Uh, you have your messages, so you can submit and send messages to other users in your course or other students, or submit messages directly to your faculty member um, as well. But the most important part for you is going to be the courses tab, because this is where all of your courses that you take here at Salem University are going to live, and this is how you're going to access them. So. Uh, you know, when you log into Blackboard, you know, you're getting ready to go to class. You're going to go ahead and click on that courses tab here on the left hand side. Then it's going to display your courses by month. Uh, and you can change here the drop down. So if you want to see the courses coming up, um, upcoming, we can change it to that. Uh, or, you know, we can also, um, uh, you know, keep it, uh, go back in time and see a course that we took maybe last month um, as well. So you can navigate all this, but once you find a class that, uh, the class that you need to, to enter into, you're simply going to click on the course and voila, that's going to take you right into the class um, that you want to be in. And then from there, again, you're just going to use the left hand navigation. Um, anytime you're in a class and maybe you want to get back to your organization page in Blackboard or the main menu, you're just going to click the big green X. That's going to take you back um, to your main navigation here. And you can go back through and use your left-hand navigation, including finding your organization page, uh, to get back to maybe tutor.com or the Writing Center um, or other uh, parts of uh, the main organization page of Blackboard. But that's basically it. That's a, a, a nice 
overview uh, of how to access Blackboard uh, and what Blackboard looks like uh, as a, a general overview for you as a student here at Salem University. Uh, so without further ado, let's look at and recap our main highlights from this online orientation tutorial. And remember our key takeaways. Don't forget to bookmark www.salemu.blackboard.com. After you log into Blackboard, the organization page is going to be the tab that has important student information and links that you will need. Whenever you're in Blackboard, use the left-hand navigation to find the tab or area that you need. Remember, when you're ready, click on Courses to access your Salem U online class. And that's how we navigate to and navigate around Blackboard, our online class platform. Be sure to check out the rest of our online orientation tutorials, including our next topic, to ensure your success here at Salem University. Until next time, Tigers!